what's up everyone it's your girl shay here and of course like always i'm coming out with my video for this week's motivation monday and i know last week i did a part one about letting go when it came to situations now this week i'm doing part two but this is with letting go of people now i know when it comes to letting go of people it can be very difficult because there's so many things involved in it and that's mostly talking about like how close you know this person, whether or not they know your family, what's your current relationship with them, what kind of relationship that you want to have with them later on, if you want to have one, things like that of that nature. And I know letting go of people can be very difficult. Some people leave your life for a reason and some people you actually have to let go because they're not adding any value to your life. Maybe they're constantly putting you down. Maybe they're making you constantly feel anxious. Maybe they'll make, they're making you feel depressed. But once again, letting go of a person is very, very difficult, especially if that person's a family member or a close friend or someone that you're in a romantic relationship relationship with, that can be very, very difficult. And I can't tell you how to do it because everyone has their own way of doing it. Some people let go of someone by doing it slowly but surely as in if the person asks them to hang out or things like that they just slowly but surely you know like tell them no and sometimes that person gets the hint and they just stop and then you guys just go your separate ways some people are very upfront about it and will tell the person look i'm done i don't i don't want to do this anymore i would recommend that if they're like someone that you're romantically involved with because you never want to just ghost on someone which is where you just stop talking to them or you never want to just tell them you want to stop you know hanging out because slowly but surely you know they're not gonna understand that but one of the best things that i that i know when it comes to letting go of someone as far as what's i don't want to say like inspired me but has like put into perspective when it comes to letting people go is actually from a play that i watched years ago and i still watch it even now number one because the play is very funny and number two because it's a little bit inspiring now the play is medea i know a lot of people don't like the medea movies but these are the plays that came out before the movies were even, um, even talked about and this is with tyler perry so if you haven't heard of medea definitely watch it but this was in the was in the medea goes to jail play and just to put into some context um is in a scene towards the latter half of the play where she is talking to her nephew Sonny and her nephew Sonny has just gone through a divorce. And they have this talk where she's talking about letting go of people. And a couple of things that she said that really touched with me was number one, if someone walks out of your life, let them go. Don't try to hold on because they'll find what they're looking for. And a lot of times, you know, they'll come back. But it's also like that phrase of, if you really love something, let it go, and if it's meant to be, it'll come back. If not, then it wasn't meant for you in the first place. So definitely remember that, especially when it comes to people and, and stuff like that. So don't feel like you have to, if you're holding on to something and it's struggling to let it go, then, then obviously it's not meant to be there. So just let it go. Um, but also one of the biggest things also is that she puts into perspective also by putting people in the category of a tree from leaves branches and then finally the roots of a tree and for me that was probably the most profound thing that i've ever that i've ever you know listened to um the same example is that when it comes to people who are in or romance or even just with friends you know you have those friends that leave you high and dry for someone else they think is cooler or better or doing a lot of things but it's kind of the whole thing of the grass is greener on the other side, right? Yeah, they, like they say, the, yeah, the grass looks greener, but they also don't know that the water bill is a lot higher. So a lot of times they look, go to the other side and they realize it's not all it's cracked up to be. So yeah, I know letting go of people is very, very difficult. Even I sometimes have issues with letting people go. And for all my friends that are watching this who think, oh no, it's like Shay trying to let me go because she doesn't talk to me much, much anymore. No that's not the reason why you'll know if I ever do that but I'm not doing that to anybody in particular at this moment but also gotta realize do the things that work best for you so for example if that person is someone who you're no longer romantically involved with and you have to like delete them off social media then do it do what works best for you if it's a friend that has been you know not very nice to you maybe you should cut them out but one of the things that you should do though I definitely recommend is definitely telling that person 
what it is that's bothering you and then see if they change it because if that person's truly your friend and they're doing something that hurts you hurt, hurts you let them know and if they even try to change it then that means they're worth keeping they're that you definitely should keep them around because they're trying their best but if that person is like not even trying and they're disregarding everything that you said then that means that person to me at least is not worth keeping around but bottom line don't try and hold on to someone if that person's trying to leave just let them go because you're probably better off without them in the first place and you'll probably also have someone that's going to come into your life that's definitely going to be better for you all right so that's it for today and as you guys realize i probably also released another video for you guys today so definitely check that out as well and i have a new video out for you guys for next week for motivational monday feel free to comment down below any topics you would like and also of course look out for my other videos on wednesday and also on saturday and give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already